The first USS Whipple, DD-15, a Truxton-class destroyer named after Abraham Whipple, was constructed by the Maryland Steel Company at Sparrows Point, Maryland. Her keel was laid on November 13, 1899, and she was launched on August 15, 1901, with Miss Elsie Pope as her sponsor. Commissioned on February 17, 1903, under Lieutenant J.U. Chase, Whipple began service with training in Chesapeake Bay before joining the Second Torpedo Flotilla of the Atlantic Fleet, operating along the East Coast and Caribbean until September 1905. Reactivated in July 1906, Whipple participated in tactical exercises and relief efforts following the 1907 Kingston earthquake in Jamaica. She undertook goodwill visits in the Caribbean, accompanied the Great White Fleet to South America, and conducted target practice in Mexico. Stationed on the West Coast from 1908, she operated between San Diego and Magdalena Bay and earned the Mexican Service Medal for patrols during the Mexican Revolution. In World War I, Whipple patrolled the Panama Canal and then moved to the Atlantic in August 1917, arriving in the Azores in September for escort duties. She later moved to Brest, France, for anti-submarine patrols and convoy escorts. On April 17, 1918, she rescued 32 crew members from the exploded munition ship Florence H. off Quiberon Bay. Post-war, Whipple returned to Philadelphia and was decommissioned on July 7, 1919. Her name was removed from the Naval Vessel Register on September 15th, and she was sold for scrap on January 3, 1920.